Sweet. Well, tomorrow. I guess I'm a loser, baby. <laughs> Hello, so I'm actually gonna jump on here with voiceovers. I'll probably pop in here and there with voiceover just because it's a lot easier to explain what I'm eating throughout my week. But we ended up our workout with some abs. Lucky absolutely slayed it and I absolutely suck at these. I genuinely don't think I got more than three reps, but it was a really, really good session. And in perfect timing, my camera died. So we had our protein shakes and for our post-workout meal, we had pesto eggs. And of course I had to have sweet toast as well, but this was really, really good. I think I'm finished. I've just proofread the whole thing. Almost 5,000 words later. Maybe it has a PDF and then I'm gonna submit it. Yay! This is gonna be my favorite part. Wow. A lot of sweat and tears. Yay! One assignment down. So yeah, I'm planning on submitting this assignment very soon and then I'm gonna quickly jump onto a console and see if everything is all right with my other assignment that I finished yesterday. And then I'm gonna submit both of them tonight, today, definitely today, like in the next hour or so. This is literally what just happened because those people down there won't shut up. Barriers, customers just keep wanting more for less and trying to cut costs. Oh my God, <laughs> shut up. Sorry. So, Sorry. yeah, this is not going well. This is like take five. And you're rough, and you're rough, so far away, far away. Whoa. Yay! I'm so happy. Second assignment down. Alright, so next meal I made us some basil chicken rice. This is really, really good. Probably one of my favorite lunches to make, and it's so easy. Okay, of my food. I only need 19 marks on my exam. We're done. I just submitted my video segment and then I'm just gonna submit the second part of my assignment now. Oh, I'm just so happy to be submitting submitting this like a couple days early. Like it actually feels so good. Anyways, I'm gonna document this moment because this is literally like one of my last few assignments ever of my degree. So it's just memorable, you know? Woohoo! That is my head. Every semester I make up one of these and this has got to be like the most satisfying part. Oh, yes. But where I find these, yeah, Jeff has been tooting about this. Four assumptions? Yeah, so if you were going to do the assumptions, I can take a different part of the write up. Oh, no, 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 it's all good. No way. You've done so much. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, not... honestly, there's three of us. We should be all good. Oh, document right there. That says 3,000 words, right? Although I'm assuming research design would probably be the heaviest. Yeah, my stuff is only this this amount. Okay. Oh, I just got off the Zoom call. That call literally went for almost two hours. I'm fucking starving. Loki gave me leftovers from last night's dinner, so I'm so grateful I don't have to cook because I'm literally starving. So I'm gonna heat this up. Scoff this down and get back to doing my assignment. I'm 
so so grateful and happy right now sorry um lucky thank you so much you are the best boyfriend i honestly have the best boyfriend in the world mm. happy tuesday so it's obviously the next morning here and i'm having a heavy leg day so on a day like this i technically always have pre-workout and i probably didn't film it but i did eat some sort of carb to definitely fuel my workout i will never ever train legs without eating something before so i really love this workout and i hope you do too So post-workout, I had coffee, of course, and classic bacon eggs on toast. I forgot to have a protein shake after my workout, so I'm having one now, and it is like exactly 12 o'clock, so probably won't have lunch till a little bit later, but I was going to go to the library today to go study, but I think I'm just going to force myself to be productive at home. This is my second thing that I'm eating, drinking today, I guess. All right, so here I'm actually prepping my dinner. I'm just marinating some beef strips that I bought from the store and I'm marinating it in this Korean sauce that I found at the Asian store and I'm just gonna pop it in the fridge till nighttime. These veggie chips are so good. Um, this is a chili flavor. I'm about to make some lunch. No, I'm gonna have like a chicken wrap. Well, I don't have wraps. <laughs> this is so good. <coughs> don't mind me choking earlier. I feel like I'm always either doing that or spilling food all over myself. So I thought it'd be a very accurate representation of how I'm eating throughout the week. But I obviously opted for some udon because I didn't have any wraps. But this has got to be one of the easiest and quickest things I can ever make. Um, I add a chicken to bulk up the protein, but it's honestly so easy and I think anyone in uni should learn how to make udon. That was so yum. This is my last procrastination event, activity, whatever it is. And I'm just gonna get started in uni because it's literally already 2.30 and when it starts getting dark, I lose productivity once again. I'm gonna commit. Let's do this. For dinner, I'm making a colourful vegetable beef stir fry. So I think that's the beauty of stir fries. Just grab whatever you want, whatever you have, cut it all up, throw it all together in a pan. And I'm obviously adding some garlic and onions first, sauteing that. And then here I'm adding the marinated beef. You could literally use seafood, chicken, whatever you want. But my top tip is definitely just to cook the veggies so they're still crunchy. Don't let them simmer too long, otherwise it gets a little soggy. But I served it with some jasmine rice and I've also got meal prep for the rest of the week, which is always really, really handy. I honestly haven't had stir fry in so long. I remember when I first moved out, this was like the only thing I knew how to cook like well, because it's just so easy. But yeah, haven't had a good old stir fry in a very long time. I'm very excited. And look how colorful it is. Like, I'm literally eating the rainbow. Mmm. Mmm. That Korean bulgogi sauce was a good decision. Okay, so I've just gone out of the shower. I've cleaned the whole kitchen. I swear there is nothing better than like cooking and like everything's all messy, but then you clean up the kitchen and fill up all the water bottles in the house and put it in the fridge and you have meal prep for the week. Like, 
nothing will beat that feeling. I'm about to have this um, Audi dupe for, oh my god, what are they called? Canettos? But what's the other real thing called? A drumstick. A drumstick. A drumstick. Oh my god, I don't even know. But I got the poison berry flavor. Yummy! You can probably already tell, but I eat a really balanced diet and I don't restrict myself from any food groups. So if you can get anything out of this video, just remember that one ice cream won't make you fat, like a salad won't make you skinny and just enjoy food. It is 11 p.m. My Zoom call with my team just finished, so I can finally go to bed. It was actually a not so bad meeting. Um, I feel like it was really productive. So yeah, I'm really excited for bed. I'm really excited for another productive day tomorrow. I'm still on the fence about if I should. I'm definitely not starting at home because that was a fucking fail today, but we'll see. We'll see how I feel in the morning. I think I've just accepted the fact that I'm probably just gonna have a rest day tomorrow. I've had really good sessions the last two days. I feel like tomorrow I just really need to wake up and get on with like my uni stuff rather than working out, even though it does make me feel better. Anyways, that is enough chit chat from me. I will talk to the vlog tomorrow morning when I am prepping all my food for the library. Today's a rest day and I'm going straight to the library for a big day of studying which means lots of food to fill my brain so this is like regular snacks that I would usually bring along to the library because um, sometimes I might not have access to a fridge but this was also my breakfast that I had before heading out. I didn't vlog at all this day because I really wanted to focus on my assignments but it's night time and I've probably come to Lockie's and I'm still grinding and still going on with my assignments unfortunately. Today is Thursday. I have three assignments due tomorrow. And at the moment, I've woken up to a message saying that I have to rewrite a thousand words of my portion of the group assignment because, yeah, some other results came up with our analysis section. So, guess who's doing that first thing in the morning and fixing a thousand words? Ah! I'm just so excited for tomorrow because once tomorrow's over, the purpose of this weekly vlog. We'll conclude and I'm just so excited for the weekend. This is what my calendar looks like. Two more boxes left and I am done. We're about to try. Fake Kit Kat from Audi with double time. Yes. It's just an excuse to have chocolate, to be honest. As you saw earlier for lunch, I had a chicken salad that Lucky made for us and for dinner I'm just heating up the stir fry that I made earlier in the week. Jokes it was like yesterday, but yeah, I'm going with the late night studies. Good morning. So today is actually so excited. I'm so excited for today and the next two days. I'm actually done with my assignments by the end of the day. So the plan is I can finally gym. That's what I'm doing this morning. Literally woke up like an hour ago, got ready for the gym, going to smash out legs. And then after that, I'm going to go to the shops and grab a few bits and bobs because it's Lockie's birthday tomorrow. Um, but yeah, right now I'm gonna make myself some cereal to have before my workout and then I'm also gonna submit my individual assignment before I go to the gym. And then when I come back, I'm submitting my last two assignments which are massive group assignments and I've had absolutely enough of fucking group assignments. I will not miss this shit, I swear to god. Making some cereal before I head off to the gym. But my almond milk was off, so I have a new bottle here, but like, who wants room temperature milk with their cereal? So, I'm improvising to make this cold. This is like the Freedom Exo Crunch, but like, Choc Pop versions. It's really yum. Alright. While I do think I should proofread it again because I proofread it last night and I was really tired. I just can't be fucked. So my favorite thing is like 
looking at how pretty it is and then like downloading it in PDF, PDF form. Like that, that shit makes me so happy. But it is happening. This is my last individual paper for my Life It Be Cute. I've just been dreaming of this day this whole three weeks. Like the last three weeks has been such a grind. We've done it. I'm so happy. Thank you very much. All right. Let's go to the gym. I just had the best session. I ended up doing like a full body rather than just hitting legs, lower body. So, yeah. I'm actually so excited to go to the shops. I don't know why. I just feel like all I've been doing, well, the only places I've been the last like month is literally the gym, my house, Lockie's house, or the library. So, I'm bloody excited. Okay, so I just got home from the shops and I've picked up Lucky's last, oh, maybe second last present. He's been wanting this plant. It's in like a really cute holder. You can't really see it right now, but I got him the plant, which I'm so happy about. It is so freaking cute. And the lady like put it in a gift box for me. She was so lovely. And it's obviously just going to be me and him on his birthday. So all the cakes were like pretty big. So I just got these two really cute cakes. I got a chocolate mug cake one and a raspberry pistachio cake. I'm so excited to eat these tomorrow. And I also got some snacks from the Asian grocery store. I got mochi and my big bag of chips for the drive down to the Gold Coast tomorrow because yeah, we're just doing like this activity tomorrow so I just got some snacks for the drive and then I've also just picked up some string and wrapping paper balloons as well so I think I'm gonna start wrapping up actually no I'm gonna go back to my desk I'm gonna eat because I'm really hungry and then I'm gonna get back onto my laptop submit my last ever group assignment and then I'm gonna wrap the presents which I love like I love getting presents ready for people and then like wrapping it up and like making it all nice so I'm gonna do that but I'll show you what I decide to eat for my post workout. This probably looks super random to some people, but it's basically just like pizza, breakfast toast. I had some ham, mushrooms, and cheese on and it. I'm very excited to eat this. Huh. Mm. Yay! And that is a wrap. I hate group assignments. So basically this Friday was a really, really big day for me because it was the final day of my three week assessment cram. I basically had assignments due one after another. I'm pretty sure like eight or 10 assignments due within the three weeks. So it was really, really full on, but it's finally all worth it because the next day is actually Lockie's birthday. So I'm just prepping for that. Yeah, it looks like this. So yeah, I think I'm just gonna put that ribbon on all the presents and make it look really cute. So today is actually the 11th of June. I think it's been like two weeks since I filmed like my last finals assessment cram week situation. But yeah, it's been two weeks and today I am actually submitting my final, final, like final assessment piece ever for my course, my degree, uni, everything like Anyways, I've been up since six or seven or something and I've just kind of been doing a due today, do today situation. I feel weird. It's a really like big day for me and a big deal for me. I don't know. I just take a lot of pride in the uni that I do and I know in future when I look back on this video or on this day, 
I'm gonna be like, holy fuck, I did it. I'm so excited to submit. It feels weird, but I also feel like I'm happy, I'm really happy. But yeah, this is my last ever paper for my marketing call and I'm about to submit it. Oh my I god, I feel so emotional. This whole month I've just been an emotional wreck. I feel like a lot of things are coming to an end and it's just all flowing through me and I'm letting myself feel the emotion, cry when I need to and feel the emotions whenever they come by. So right now I feel like crying. Oh my god. Anyways, I am officially done for good I still have like an exam but I only have one because I had so many assignments I'm just gonna have a nice day off of uni for the rest of the day I have no work and I'm gonna go hit the gym I also need to eat my eating has been fucking shit the last few days I'm so happy not sure if this will be the outro for the video but if it is then I'm very happy that I filmed this week obviously a really big deal for me I'm literally gonna be an adult <sighs> I don't know I think I just I just need, I can't even talk I just need to shut up anyways thanks for watching bye